five world news. On this tax bill tonight, how will President Trump and his family fare? And did he keep his campaign promises? What the White House told our Cecilia Vega today. Tonight, the White House celebrating what it calls a promise made and a promise kept. A promise like this. I took this job on behalf of the forgotten men and women of our country. But guess what? They are forgotten no more. Most working and middle class Americans will get a tax cut, but independent analysts say eventually their taxes will go up. And the president recently promised a tax code so simple you could file on a postcard. Great job. Thank you very much. I, I didn't know I was going to be given a prop. Can I have a bag? It's my only copy. It's yours. It's yours. That postcard not happening either. The 503 page tax bill still means a lot of paperwork for taxpayers. The president insisting time and time again he's going to pay big league under the plan. It's not good for me, believe me. This is going to cost me a fortune, this thing, believe me. Also, not true. Here's how President Trump stands to benefit income taxes for the ultra rich will drop. Business owners, including those in commercial real estate like the Trumps, get a big break from what's known as a pass-through deduction. And his family stands to save millions on inheritance taxes. The president has said that this tax bill is going to cost him a fortune. That's actually not the case. How does he figure this is going to cost him a lot of money? Look, we expect um, that it likely will, certainly on the personal side, uh, could cost the president a lot of money. But he stands to benefit from pass-through deductions, top-rate tax reduction, estate tax exemption is doubled. He's going to make money on that. Uh, look, again, uh, this is a tax plan that we hope benefits all Americans. And Cecilia Vega live at the White House tonight. Cecilia, you press Sarah Sanders on whether President Trump will benefit from this tax bill. She said over and over again that this bill will cost the president, but she did seem to then couch her words. Yeah, when it comes to his business dealings, David, Sarah Sanders says that the president could benefit from these tax cuts. She still maintains that he will take a hit when it comes to his personal income. But David, the president stands to win on both fronts. All right, Cecilia Vega at the White House.